from Indy Streaming News Leader. This is a WRTV update. I'm WRTV's Kelsey Anderson, and these are your latest headlines. Kokomo police say they found skeletal remains in a rural part of Miami County while investigating the 2016 disappearance of Karina McClurklin. The announcement comes one day after a person was arrested and charged with the murder in the case. The remains have been sent to Fort Wayne to be identified. On Monday, 57-year-old Flint Farmer was arrested and charged with murder. Police say more arrests are expected. And today, today, the House is expected to vote on a bill to safeguard protections for access to contraceptives. Some states started restricting access to certain types of birth control following the Supreme Court's decision to overturn Roe v. Wade. The bill protects methods ranging from birth control pills, IUDs, and emergency contraceptives. Senate Republicans have released their inflation relief plan labeled Senate Bill 3. Senate Bill 3 lays out a plan for capping the gas tax so it can't go above 29.5 cents per gallon. The draft legislation calls for the cap to last through June of 2023. The legislation would also suspend the 7% sales tax on residential utilities for six months. Governor Holcomb's proposed $225 refunds are not included, but State Speaker Todd Houston says his chamber's inflation legislation will include it. And Todd, let's get a look at your weather here on this Thursday morning. You know, as we go throughout the day today, we'll enjoy sunshine and high temperatures that eventually get up into the low 90s here across uh, the area. And as we work our way into the evening hours, we start off still pretty hot right around 7 p.m. And temperatures only slowly start to drop off as we work our way throughout the day today. The humidity is around. It's not quite as high as it is uh, or was yesterday. And then as we go into the day tomorrow, it's kind of a carbon copy of today, to be honest with you, mostly sunny sky. Guys, temperatures in the 90s, but for over the weekend, we crank it up Saturday and Sunday highs near 95. All right, thanks, Todd. For more stories and weather you need to know, download the WRTV mobile app. Thanks for joining us.